We're starting to equip a bunch of Valkyrie stuff. Anyway, hello everyone, Priest Kuda here. Welcome back to more of God of War. I had a brain fart after the last video. I after the last video, I was like, hey, wait, we haven't like looked at that axe pommel we got. And then it turns out it's comparable to the one we've been using this whole time, except it focuses on runic and strength perks rather than, you know, rather than, you know, perks that we get just by doing attacks instead of focusing on executioner's cleaves, which I'm not focusing on executioner cleaving. I'm focusing on bouncing a bas bouncing a basketball or ri or cracking the whip in my enemy's face. Faced? Yes. I crack the whip in my enemy's face and they go Pow! And it's a great time for all. Everybody have good laugh? Everybody chortle? Team in the back, Scowls. We don't talk about team in the back. Team in the back, get an accident in the face. Don't. Okay, don't. Why my brain went that way, I don't know. Anyway, today's episode, I think I'm probably going to regret this, but I'm going to go back to the two realms we ha we know that there are Valkyries in. We're going to go back to the two realms that I know that Valkyries are in and attempt to complete those just so we can wrap up this Valkyrie side quest. And again, I may be w in way over my head on this thinking I can tackle every Valkyrie that's left but I feel like at this point handling the one Valkyrie that handling the Valkyrie that basically I was on a time limit for I think my chances of success are much higher than I than I think again considering you know how many how many things I've I can't think I can't even put the words into scope here considering how many Valkyrie challenges I've gone past and thwarted simply because I stubbornly pushed my head pushed my head through all of those challenges now just to touch on the Niflheim bit because this is kind of Alpine I missed its gentle bees and the sweet smell of honeysuckle and blood well Judging by the sky, the Light Elves are in control of the light this time. Explain. You see, the Light Elves and Dark Elves... ...are always fighting over the light. That part we know. But did you also know that control of the light has changed hands no less than 213 times? Really? It's true. Each side believes itself the rightful keepers of the light and argue they're simply fighting for survival. But the fact of the matter is, the war has been going on so long, they don't know who they are without it. But yeah, just to... Just to touch on that a little bit, it, the whole Niflheim bit, is... Is that we're going to be missing the last axe upgrade. So our Blades of Chaos are going to be the strongest they're going to be. Unless something happens with these Valkyries that I don't know about. But yeah, like... We're basically... Our Axe is not going to get its po most powerful strength. Our Blades, though, are. Which sucks, because I actually was kind of... go. I was kind of plan uh, mentally prepared for things to go the other way. But our Axe was going to be the strongest, and our Blades were not going to be as strong at all. But hey, so, say Levy. Clear this up for me. Spot up. Fine means land of the Dark Elves. Right? Right. But you said the Dark Elves have been here now for a really long time. And anyway, aren't dwarves supposed to be from Spartalfarm? They don't look like Dark Elves. Don't you think so? Then you are vastly more perceptive than the Aesir. They are the ones who apparently can't tell the difference. And they are the ones who came up with that name. Dwarves actually call their home realm Nidavlia. So the Dark Elves aren't from Svartalfheim at all? Not even a bit. They're just elves of another color. Nobody knows who came first, but they all come from Alfheim. Why do they fight all the time if they're really the same? That is adorable. Huh? It is the way of the world. Oh. Well, that's sad. Yeah, that's the uh, parallel to real life. Hey, let's not let's not uh 
Let's not draw attention to that. Let's just go swimming our way through Alfheim. Swimming, I say. Uh, paddling our way through Alfheim and see what kind of trouble we can make. Oh, look, trouble. I'm going to go make it. So, from what I can tell, and again, I, I've looked these up in the past just to know where they are. I don't know anything else about these. I've looked these battles up. I've looked up where these battles are just so I can get there. But I don't have any other plans for uh, for these battles. Oop. Ow. Who said? The mom? She lied. Okay, fine. We'll do it your way. Nope. Executioner. Hey. Okay, fine. You don't want to do things this way. Listen, I'm... I have been way too on board with how this works, my my guy. Thanks for the healing stone. I kind of need it because I'm just mashing the attack button. Are you are you about done? Are you about done? Lord. Okay. So we did. So I did find this chamber a long time ago, and like I said, I've been finding these chambers, and I know where these chambers are, and where to find all the Valkyries. So I know where they are. I don't know what their fights will entail once we get there. And right now, my brain just wants to do the Valkyrie fights. I don't want to do anything additional unless we come back to an area at a later point. But with that being said, let me uh. Oh, I can't. Oh, it is removed. Good. And there's the mystical portal. So yeah, there is this one here in Alfheim. There's one more in Helheim. And if there's another one, I'm going to say it's in Jotunheim. And in Jotunheim, who knows where that, what that'll all entail. But the point of this is, is to hopefully show... To be doing everything as I am, is to hopefully show what it is what it is like to get like the quote unquote secret yeah the quote unquote the the like secret extra cutscene that plays after the credits that helps roll into God of War Ragnarok cuz the the dev team for this I don't uh, Santa Monica Sony Santa Monica I believe the dev team for this game literally literally said, yeah, we're working on a sequel to this game within this game. Well, I guess they said they would, and then they got green and then they got greenlit to actually do it once once uh once the big up once the big dogs in charge are like, oh, this is making money. Sure, you can make another one. Uh I don't need that. I will take the treasure though. Cause all this hack silver has got a fun upgrading my pommel one last time. Let me guess there's a Valkyrie in here. We're gonna fight her. There's a trap spirit in there. Quiet, head. We are gonna fight her. Oldrun. Why is called Why is she called Oldrun? I have a feeling that we probably could have fought her a lot earlier. Oh, this is where this is where this whole thing comes from. Okay, switch weapons, grab this, and pop it. Okay, that's fun. And now we're onto the Blades of Chaos. I really wish you had more arrows, not gonna lie. Okay, she's fast. Okay. Again, she's fast. I need to remember this. There's a crystal back here. Pop! 
I do like using the Blaze of Chaos a lot, I'm not gonna lie. Like, the axe has its uses. The, the Blaze of Ca or the Axe has its uses, but right now is not that use. I almost bit it. Ow. And hopefully I can get this off before hip. Okay, she didn't hit that. I'm starting to understand your wiles, lady. I'm sorry. Okay. This is gonna hurt a little bit. Pop! Dang! Oh, this is definitely a challenge I could have done earlier, I think. This is definitely designed to be done earlier on the game. I may have done all the hard Valkyries a lot earlier on. Oops! <laughs> a lot earlier than I was supposed to, anyway. Thank you. I am free. But why was I imprisoned? We think your queen did this to you. But why would Sigrun hinder our duty? That's the mystery we're trying to solve, milady. Can you think of any reason she would have to do this? No. Without the Valkyries, those who died in battle will not see Valhalla. Helheim will overflow with the souls of the departed and drown Midgard in a sea of vengeful corpses. No greater shame exists for a Valkyrie. I must go. Attempt to staunch the bleeding. Farewell. I believe you have your answer ahead. The Queen opposes Odin. She imprisoned the Valkyries to defy him. Sigrun hated Odin, no doubt about that. But her duty, her responsibility. Would she really forsake these things to get back at Odin? I don't believe it. I do. Hate is stronger than duty. We have to find the queen. We have to stop her. Aye, don't be sorry, lad. Sigrun brought this on herself. It's only wish... Well, wishing only gets you so far. How will we find her? I'm afraid I don't know. She could be anywhere, any realm. We'll find her. We have to. All of Midgard is counting on us. I just want to look at what this is. Really? That, that basically says use the Blades of Chaos. Wow. Okay. Fair enough. I'm still liking Brock set though. Like there's no doubt in my mind that there's no doubt in my mind if I went through the effort, if I if I did go through the effort to uh Yeah, if I there is no doubt in my mind that if I went through Yo, hold on. Is there any bonuses on also? There's no raven in here. Weird. Figured there would be. Um Oh, there is one. I just can't hear it for some reason. Bye. Um, I feel like if I went through the effort to, uh, yeah, that's quite a significant downgrade, especially in vitality, oddly enough. I'm sorry, I got sidetracked. If I went through the effort to actually upgrade this stuff all the way, I have no doubt in my mind I could probably just storm through most of this game and anything else. Oh, I was going to look at the, I was going to look at that. Uh oh, this uh. Well, I didn't mean to do that, but oh wow, it gives a lot of stats. Holy cow! Yeah. Yes, please. <laughs> but yeah, if I went through the effort to actually like increase all of the uh, what you call it. Upgrade all his Valkyrie armor. I feel like I could just walk through the game without even thinking. Oh man, the tower ate the Unity Stone, didn't it? I wanted to fly again. Yes, that's a terrible pity. Sorry, Atreus. No flying today. Fly <laughs> flying lessons are canceled. Anyway, 
so last stop, at least for now, is we're gonna go to Helheim. We're gonna stop at Helheim to take care of that Valkyrie. And then once that Valkyrie is done, then we'll see about uh, finding out what happened with Sigurd. Sigurd? Sigurd? Oh, it's like game knows where I wanted to go. That or I've got a positive positive result on the 50-50 coin flip. I don't know. Take, take your results as you will on that one. But yeah, this, this whole Valkyrie thing, this was like the biggest thing I wanted to focus on. The biggest thing I wanted to wrap up with this game because I knew it had something to do with the, with the bon the additional bonus cutscene at the end of the game at the end of everything. That was the biggest thing I wanted to focus on. Everything else, like you know, clearing Niflheim, uh, clearing out the uh, Niflheim issue, uh, all of the additional side quests, like all this additional fluff, guff, and gaff, chaff, whatever you want to say, all that additional stuff is second to none for me. Why did that spark? Oh well, gonna go open it anyway. I can't believe we're back in hell. At least we're not on the side of the bridge where those visions will torture us. It's so cold. My spit freezes when I talk. That's... Sorry, I'm just having fun. I got distracted. <laughs> Here, go, go play with the wall. Go play in traffic. No. And bounce. God, I love doing that. It is over. But yeah, this whole... Yeah, this whole stuff. For, sorry, I guess I'm getting so distracted because, like, I'm hell bent on getting this Valkyrie stuff finished up now. Okay, so where we need to do this is yeah. So where we need to do this is located basically where we were in our first trip here to Helheim, and I think we could have done this. Anytime that we had recovered the boy, or yeah, anytime we had gotten the boy back, we could have done this. So we're not, yeah, we can't even go beyond there because it's collect. Can we? Now, now this is exploring time. Because we literally just did, we literally collapsed this down, but where I wanted to go may not be over here. Actually, it might be here. Let's just do one of these. Some of the stuff might be here, but yeah, we haven't come back with the boy yet, so this is, you know, the exploration part of the game right now. Uh, shoot, please. But yeah, there was a lot of stuff we couldn't do just because... There's a lot of world tree sap around here, and we needed the boys' shock arrows to get access to it. Oh, hey, look, money to money to get by selling. Hello, I heard that. I heard that. Now the other thing is, well, I see it. Oh, right on my head. I like to think, like, the headcanon for those Cravens a lot of time is just, like, it's like, ah, I am hidden and out of and out of reach. I cannot be touched. And while the axe is flying, it just goes, wait, 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 wait. Just the immense panic of a bird. Oh, hello. Been storms. Epic talisman. Summon a storm of ice that prevents Kratos' attack from being... It would severely hinder a lot of my stuff, except for my runic. I kind of like this, although we'll see what the... If I can upgrade, we'll see what it upgrades to. The realm shift may be getting replaced. For how long I've used it and how much I've been enjoying it, it may be getting replaced soon. 
Oh, hey, there's another one over there. Uh, we're gonna go back across. But yeah, this has just been. I would. I don't want to say this has been fun re-exploring things. Oh boy, re-exploring hell. It's the place where you go when you die. Um. But yeah, we'll see about upgrading some stuff next time we talk to Brock and Sindri. Uh, we have to go down and around. Because if that talisman is anywhere, at, like any portion amount of decent, I am. Oh, oh wait, we don't have to use this. We can just walk right up here. There we go. I was like, wait, where's this? Where's it coming from? This is it. And that's the artifact we've been missing. Yes. Hey, we got 40 of them. I feel better knowing that I got 40 of them now. Oh, there's still more brute juice to get here. Dang. Hi, boy. Welcome, welcome to the party. Yeah, we got 40 of the Odins. Or 40 of the Odins? Yeah, I got 40 Odins. I'm not sure if we'll open up all the secret chambers, considering that I think this is the last chamber we have to even open at this point. Are you... You're mocking me at this point. No, I'm going to hit you from downtown here. Once again with fervor. While I walk over that to make sure that it does open. So we have our quick way out. And is that another brooch? Oh my gosh, they're like... One more for the All the brooches are here. This was... Sorry. Brain is short-circuiting on me right now. But yeah, all this... Um, additional stuff... We're just about wrapped up with the additional stuff. The side quests that I wanted to handle. Uh, re at Max Health. Yes. It's another Valkyrie. Can we try to free her? Mm. We can't just leave her like this, brother. Do not rush me, Ed. When we are prepared, I will attack. Shockers, I'm prepared. Walk into her and start swinging. Oh my gosh, really? Oh. Are we really we're really doing this the step on me bit? Uh Apparently she can just instant kill you. Okay. Cause you probably heard it behind me talking what little I was talking. I was mashing B that whole time. Apparently, if she just gets you on the ground... Like, I can't even burst right now. Okay. Okay. We'll see what this is. So, like, you can... May have to employ a different strat here. But I'll see when I actually get it handled. And the other strat is to use these blades.
So that's what it's like to fight a grappler. Oppressive. I hate it. <laughs> oh, funny game analogies. Freedom. Where is your queen? My queen? She did this to you. She's letting the dead take over Midgar. This cannot be. I didn't want to believe it either, milady. But we have to find her. Where is she? I can't say for sure. But the rock stole of Alkir's. If the Council of Eight are reunited, perhaps she will answer our call. Looks like this was our last one. Aye, lad. Onto the rook stole our Valkyrs then. If you remember, it's next to the two oarsmen statues on the path we took to Thamur's chisel. This queen of yours, she is strong, yes? Stronger than these other Valkyries we have faced. That's putting it mildly, brother. Then we must prepare ourselves. Hmm. Whoa, hold on. That's, uh... It's not much of a downgrade, but we haven't upgraded them yet. Yeah, there's like a bunch of these pommels we haven't even upgraded, so they may be they may be serviceable in new time, but yeah. What are you doing? Uh Asgard Shard of Existence. Oh, it's an I don't think I want it. Like it's tempting, but I don't want it. I'm here for the Asgardian steel just so I can have it. And then we'll look at... Oh, I can't even upgrade, because I think if I go to upgrade, it's going to force me to talk to the dwarves for story purposes. And I doubt there's one chill... And I don't think there is a dwarf just chilling by the entrance, and I'm not going to make a special side trip. I'm not going to make a special side trip to another area where there's only a single dwarf, just to have that handled. But yeah, just... That's, we have defeated all the, Val well, all but one Valkyrie at this point. And I am so relieved that we have done that. I have a feeling that we have to fight the Queen of the Valkyries, and that's going to be a fight for sure. Okay, do you guys do this here? Yes, you do. Dang it. They do story stuff here. I don't want to have story stuff, like, tossed in with all this quote-unquote side quest stuff just for just for pacing of the entire episodes or video series so i'm gonna go find a valkyrie queen and because it's just in midgard we're just gonna go to midgard maybe we can find a camp uh, outside of midgard that or maybe i can find a camp or just one of them inside of midgard and i can use that to uh yeah use that to upgrade our stuff that we need to but I will cut here for now, and I'll see you at either a upgrading station. I'll see you at either upgrading station or in uh, just at the Valkyries, the, the Council of the Valkyries pit. Okay. Yeah, I need the hack seller to upgrade that, but I could upgrade it, which means I could sell stuff. But let's look at. Gosh, it is tempting. Okay. So, let's just sell off stuff we're not going to use. Because we're not going to use this anymore. It won't even let us... I don't think it's even going to let us sell things that we can... Oh yeah, I know we have plenty of hack silver. It's not going to let us sell things that are unique. So, this is a big boon. And I'm sorry if this take if this is gonna take a while, but this is like the last. I feel like this is gonna be the last major hurdle before any. Uh, Anything you need, young sir. Yeah, this is like the last major hurdle. Let's not do that. Let's see. I haven't even upgraded these. But yeah, it's just... Okay, I can't upgrade those. But the waste armor, I can upgrade.
Why do I want to do that? Anyway. So upgrade this. Uh, sir, you are working together on this axe now. A little less runic, but a little more strength and cooldown. I'm actually going to take that. And need more axe silver to upgrade it again. Yes, dear boy. We're selling it all, baby. What more do you need? Done and done. Uh, I need you to take all of these... Just take all this. This is all poo poo. Okay. Now let's see if I can upgrade. Oh my god, that'd be so much better. I don't think I've got enough for that, but I have enough to do this at least. Shocker, guess what I am? I ne so the last one was I needed 90k, huh? to upgrade my Talisman of the Realms. I can make that happen. I didn't realize you could sell Spartalheim steel. No, okay. Um, that was what I needed. I'm doing all this because, like, this is basically the last check of the of the game for like super hard mode stuff. Okay. And now. I feel somewhat ready. Yeah, I need the chilling mist and Niflheim for that. So I've upgraded everything that I can at this point. So let's go ahead and learn about Valkyries. And after we learn about Valkyries, we'll go fight the queen of them. Oh boy. I don't know if I'm ready for this, but I'm gonna make myself ready for this. I feel ready for this. Especially because I just upgraded everything as far as I can, at least from, from what I can tell. I feel like I'm ready for this. It feels so strange that like the biggest side quests that I was worried about, we're gonna wrap up or I'm gonna wrap up here finally. And I think there is still like a little bit of a uh, there's still like a little bit of other things that can be handled, like I do remember that there's a lot of story from what I remember, there's a lot of story left to dig through. Anyway, just make sure that's activated, because that's going to be our way back to the shop in between episodes. Let's take a quick pause here and learn about Valkyries. Ah, Gondul. Beautiful Gondul. And? Huh? That's it? Beautiful Gondul? No story or anything? Uh, oh, sorry, lad. The sight of Gondul always took my breath away. Gondul had a silver tongue, a sharp wit, and struck a figure so stunning it literally drove men insane. Odin forbid her from setting foot in Midgard after a time, as insanity is not a welcome trait in Valhalla. I see. So appar apparently if you can apparently if you can just wow oh, the world apparently if you could you can just wow the world with your charisma that's all you need to be a valkyrie that's what i'm being told anyway this is rota a chooser of the slain i thought all the valkyrie did that not exactly lad although that is what they're most famous for and by far their greatest responsibility you've seen what happens to the dead without the judgment of the valkyries hellwalkers that's right rota gunnar schooled without them to clean up the aftermath of battle 
hell overflows with souls meant for Valhalla. A sorry state of affairs. Rota must be beside herself. She's something. We'll say that much. She is something right now. And I believe this is the one that gave me the most hell. Well, well. Hilda, mistress of battle. She and Odin got on quite well, actually. Her and the other Valkyries, not so much. She would spend most of her time here in Midgard observing discord between the living and sewing some up herself from time to time. She lived for conflict. Some say she was conflict personified. I wonder what will become of her now that she's free. She'll still she'll still, still cause conflict. And the final of the Valkyries we've slain. Oh god, this is a long time coming. I'm a little I'm a little worried, not gonna lie. Old rune. Once the daughter of a powerful chieftain. She fell defending him during a reaver attack. Old rune was escorted to Valhalla, where she chose to devote her afterlife to the pursuit of knowledge above all else. Quite unusual behavior amongst the constant drinking and feasting of her fellow Valhallian denizens. How'd she end up a Valkyrie? Odin. He saw a kindred spirit in Orun's single-minded pursuit of knowledge. He appointed her as a Valkyrie's resident historian. <laughs> That's what I was waiting for. <laughs> All right. So let's close this loop on the Valkyries today. Oh boy. Yeah. So she is basically every Valkyrie at once. That was gonna be bad. Yeah, she's gonna be every. She's gonna be every Valkyrie at once. And this is probably going to be the hill I get to climb today. Sorry, not today. Like I said, she's going to be every Valkyrie fight combined. And I'm not ready for this, in the slightest, if you couldn't tell by the fact I'm in, I'm in red health. Okay, it's just gonna play, gonna play safe. Whoa. That ain't gonna work.
bitch. I have almost won three times now, as you can tell by the health bars. I have not changed my strategy. It is pure RNG bullshit. And I have been at this for almost three goddamn hours. Sometimes it's far enough, sometimes it's never far enough, and there's no indication when it's far enough. Combination attack she never has fucking done, and I'm just supposed to adapt, I'm just supposed to fucking learn. No, that's bullshit. Never has done the combination of moves ever this entire fucking three hours. Random, random ass pull when it's so close to being done. What does it fucking matter if I can't recover from an attack and she basically makes a move that makes it so it's impossible for me to block if I just goof once. If I fuck up once, if I just make one little slip of my fingers, I fuck up the whole fight. I have no idea of the swing take. I literally took a two minute break just to clear my head, to calm down. This fight is bull. Like I've at this point memorized almost, almost every single one of her moves, how to dodge every single one of her moves in tandem and have doing the same rollout for each move and correlation every single time she does anything. It's RNG bull because it's literally roll dice. What attack move? Okay, roll dice again. What amount of delay between attacks is it going to be? That's really it. That's really all it is. It's literally two RNG rolls of which attack and how much delay between attacks. That's it. And it's a random roll of dice if I can break out of that. There is little to no skill with this fight. It is all RNG rolls start to fucking end. Would you like to... Can I... Yeah, thank you. I've only been doing it for five fucking hours. No, I'm not doing okay back here because it's random bullshit if I'm allowed to break out of that or not, even though I'm mashing the same for ferocity I have been for the past three to four fucking hours. Just take it. Uh, just take the hit. You're punished for using the Blades of Chaos. You're punished for, for using the Axe. You're punished for going too fast. You're punished for going too slow. You're punished for using the boy too much. You're punished for, for using the boy too little. You're punished, you're punished, you're punished, you're punished, you're punished, you're punished, you're punished. And it's all because of fucking RNG. I'm getting fucking fed up with it. Oh, I'm allowed to, I'm allowed to counter at that time? Thanks.
Yes! It has been four hours of this. Four hours. Four goddamn hours. Thank you, friends. You have saved the Valkyries. Sigrun, how did this happen? Namir, is that you? You have been freed, but... Freedom comes at a price, milady. You speak truly. Countless winters we serve the Allfather. But only through his union to the Queen did we ever taste some measure of freedom. But aren't you the Queen? There has only been one Queen of the Valkyries, the Goddess Freya. When Odin severed her wings, I served in her absence, but it wasn't enough for the Allfather. He used an archaic piece of magic, corrupting my sisters. I tried to contain the damage by imprisoning them in places where they could cause no harm, but soon I lost myself as well. Sigrun, I'm sorry for being so worthless. I could have done something, or tried at the very least. What will you do now? I must reunite with my sisters. Together we can restore balance to the realms. You have the eternal blessings of the Valkyries. sound very happy about it. It's difficult to be happy about anything when you're a reanimated head. I'm grateful we were able to set the Valkyries free. But so much of this could have been avoided, only... You said it yourself, Head. It does not matter anymore. The past is the past. Well, that's awfully cheerful coming from you. I am in a good mood. The dwarves will make use of this helm. Your dad's a wee bit single-minded, isn't he, lad? Definitely. There better be some goddamn amazing good loot from this. That's actually kind of awesome. Njord's Temple Stone. I probably read that wrong because I was going through quick. Called uh, Okay. A new axe pommel to mess around with. My last bit of perfect as guardian steel I'll probably get in the entire game unless there's some kind of BS challenge. And the helm will be used for something. But there we go. That was the challenge I wanted to do the most out of this game. The Ravens, uh, afterthought. All of the other favors, afterthought. H Niflheim, no thank you. The Valkyrie Queen, that is where my sights were set. For my own little flair on this entire project. Granted, I'm not the first person to ever do that on this platform. But I have indeed done it. And now, I'm going to save everything so I don't lose it. But everyone, I do want to thank you all so much for watching this episode of God of War. Come back next time when we will actually go forward with the plot. I'll see you folks then. Take care. Big bag of fucking bullshit. <laughs>